Though her work originates in drawing and painting, the German artist Anne Imhoff is best known for performance pieces that test the limits of bodies in real time. Her first ever artwork was a boxing match staged in Frankfurt's red light district, where she lives. The fight lasted four hours, as long as the band that Imhoff cast kept playing. Imhoff, 39, prefers to place audience and performer on equal footing, forcing both into the role of hypervigilant voyeur. Such was the case with Faust, her unsettling installation for the German pavilion at this year's Venice Biennale, which earned the artist the Golden Lion, the exhibition's highest honor. Faust featured barking Doberman pinsters behind Andy riot fences, and aloof, androgynous dancers in streetwear, who animated the pavilion's imposing Nazi-era architecture by climbing transparent partitions, perching on platforms, and crawling under a raised glass floor. Among Imhoff's close-knit group of performers is Eliza Douglas, her fiancé and an artist in her own right. The couple have collaborated on Imhoff's works and costumes and even on a painting and drawing exhibition that ran at Gallery Buchholz in New York this past fall, this portfolio for W marks their first joint fashion shoot. Douglas modeled for Helmut Lang as a teenager, and it was she who introduced him Hoof to the fashion world, a week after the two met, in 2016, when the stylist Lotta Vokova invited Douglas to open Demnig Vachalia's first Balenciaga show, in Paris. Then as now, Imhoff was fascinated by the way fashion is so in the moment but, at the same time, all about taking from history, she says. How fashion uses color and form also intrigues her, as does how it allows the person wearing it to be transgressive. In these, 